Markets have been in a slightly more optimistic mood overnight, helped by reports that U.S. officials are studying ways they might temporarily expand Federal Deposit Insurance Corp coverage to all deposits, a move sought by a coalition of banks arguing that it is needed to head off a potential financial crisis. The European Banks Index has recovered by almost 5%, while S&P futures are now up towards 1% compared to being up just about 0.1% at the European open. ECB Kazakhs admitted that while uncertainty in financial markets is high, there's no reason to compare the situation right now with 2008, as European banks are well capitalized and supervision is much stronger now than in 2008. On the data front, German ZEW reads were discouraging, but really didn't factor into price action. The RBA minutes were out earlier in the day and have played a part with the Australian dollar softer on a dovish read of the communication on the revelation that a pause was still on the table. And the New Zealand dollar is getting hit hardest on the back of a worrying trade deficit print in New Zealand. Look no further than the Euro Kiwi cross for an indication of just how much these two currencies have been moving in opposite directions on this Tuesday. Into the North American Open, the hourly RSI read on this cross rate is sitting up around 90. Looking ahead, we get Canada inflation, an ECB Lagarde speech, and U.S. existing home sales. That's all for now.